you know if we try to think now it can work right so next thing i have to do is go to our ansible our ansible server right and then we have to create the inventory file that reside under ansible sorry I have to make it the directory at first make a directory then we do nano and here local group local host another group call it group and this one I use the IP address sorry for the master now to copy paste it here right 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 here must add something here obento then this ip address i will save that all right now what i have to do First thing to copy to generate pairs here on this user and then paste that peers on the master node and all as well and the same thing for our localhost means our ansible server we will try to paste that public address sorry public keys as well on this ansible server so I have explained very well what is the key pair how, how to generate them and all of this on my last on my last videos on using kubernetes jenkins and ansible as well i will leave the the link in the description or in the right top corner you can click on that and there i have explained everything the first thing i'm going to do is to generate key pairs but first thing let me ls come back to home ls then list the hidden the hide files i don't have that ssh folder here but once i will type keygen slash t rsa the type of the key of keys and once i Hit enter, hit enter, and that these are created under my home directory. If I try not to type ls la, and the files are here, and if I try now to cd in to get in that folder list, this is our private key and this is our public key. So what I want, I want to to copy this public key. To my master node right to be able to communicate that to my master node using my private key i have explained all of this on my previous video so i will not cover them again so come back this and to copy the keys we have to type ssh copy id and then the name of the user and then the ip address but if i try to do that now it will not work why because i have to enable the the password authentication in the ssd service so for that let me type sudo nano and get etc ssh then ssh p dash config and scroll down and try to increment or instead of having password authentication now i will switch it to 
yes so yes then I save that then I type sudo service this is sshd reload to apply the changes and here I will copy the address this here dot 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 and if I try to hit enter and type yes it will ask me for the Ubuntu password I don't have the password right so to do that I have to switch to the root user and then type pass wd Ubuntu and change the password of open to user now I come back here and type this password now if I try to type this now I am able to get in our open to server so I will exit and do, I will do the same thing for my Ansible server, right? I have already, if we try to get in the nano etc, I have already switched the password authentication from now to yes, ssh, then sshd underscore config, scroll down here, I have already switched that. Yes, which is here password authentication. I have switched to yes. Now, what I have to do is only type copy ID and then local host. Yes, then you have to type the password of user. And now, if I try to type SSH local host. It works now right now if I, I will exit and they will type another command to, to see if my ansible server works properly I will type ansible all means all the groups dash n king and for example if I don't I didn't create the hosts let me come here and explain. if I didn't create the inventory file the inventory file has the groups that has the IP address of the of the machines that we have want to control them remotely so if for example if you create a file under home and you call it for example hosts right so once you will like to to ping all the machines that you have control over them you must type dash n ping and then dash i and then hosts but as long as the directory ansible sorry etc ansible it is the default directory where ansible once you type this command will look will look to it is this directory right and it will find a file call it here hosts and it will read the, the the groups and the the machines that you want to have control over them remotely so if i now if i type hit enter so both of them my my master node and my local host have control over them now the next thing that i will do devops see this with devops or i can see all that here is i i want to run to run this command right so what i want to do is here in up up speak i will uncommand this right because i want this to be executed and here 